I hate you. Why did you make me watch this? This is no fun anymore. This is just sad. And the worst part here is that it could have been avoided. If Shun had the resolve to kill and could make a cold, ruthless decision to sacrifice Furuki and his family, we could have saved Pooh. And we could have saved the rest of us and we could have kept our plans going to make sure no one else is gonna, you know, get hunted down like this. But bro fucking folded. He did not make a good leadership, ex you know, a decision. Now, we can't even time leap. You know, I don't even know if we can even plunder because the one half of the eye is gone. We don't really know the mechanics of that. And Pooh? Pooh is done. And Shun couldn't even see Pooh. He's blind, yet he feels the blood and that's how they go out. So fucking sad. Which means the remainder of the episodes, like we're going to have a happy ending, right? Like, like today's episode, it's going to be like, oh, wait, there's different ways we can, you know, move forward and then happy, happy. Or maybe it's just sad, sad. Let's try to finish this season. Reconstructive surgery, you. Use eyes getting fixed up. Yeah, I thought the eye was done. Oh, my fucking god, collapse again. Why is it collapse every time? <laughs> and we're back. There is possibility in the eye, guys. Today's called Promise. Who's Promise? <laughs> he, he just stabbed him and he's bleeding and he didn't cover <laughs> He's not a doctor, fuck you. Okay, Tomori's safe. Uh, yeah, blame oh, Furuki, bro. Fuck this guy, but he's kind of right. I mean, what was he supposed to do, though? We were, like, it was such a shitty situation for you to go in with, like, literally no plans. It's just, like, last minute prep. Just go in and fucking be a hero. I, 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 I don't know. It's, it's, it, we should be blaming it all on Furuki. It's not you's fault. <laughs> Bro just said yeet time to rupture, sorry. Uh collapse. I don't know, we have two episodes left. Alright, cause this is like a national thing, like globally. Probably grieving. That blonde guy is being so unreasonable. I think a lot of the fault is on, you know, Shun. You is not the problem here. And at least we have pizza sauce. We we traded, you know, poo for pizza sauce. But hey, hey, we we have her at least. Oh, <laughs> Unless she dies today's episode, <laughs> then it's GG. Really, it was that bad? Yeah, I wonder why. But like, if the eye could heal back, and I'm not sure if it will, maybe it's just to kind of like save what's there. But ugh, a time leap? We got two episodes left, including this one. Time leap to correct the situation? Maybe that's too much cope. I don't know. ゲイ。ウェルズ、メガネアズオーズベンナイストゥ。アナシ、タカジョウハズオーズベンナイストゥ。アナシ、タカジョウハズオーズベンナイストゥ。アナシ、タカジョウハズオーズベンナイ
There she is. If her powers as an idol, the 134 techniques are true, then she should be able to do a get better, healy wheely, better eye, Try, fix your blind eye, get better eye, boo! And then the eye comes back timely, then we can save everybody, but you know, she's a fucking fraud. <laughs> Is it actually good? Oh, and then we ran out. Better not be the same fucking stew. Better be a new batch. They're gonna be probably fucking so mad that this couldn't be him. Umai, having an idol feed you like this, man. They're gonna be probably jumping off of fucking buildings so that he can be also hospitalized so you saw they can feed. But you know what? Then Misa would probably feed and say, you fucking degenerate motherfucker. You trying to do this shit? I know what you're trying to do. There she is. Good question. Where are you? The soul. What is the sky though? You just... That's exactly what that, yeah, Aimi did. It's gonna be Yusai in closure to end the season? Here she is. Is she alright? What if she's been invisible the entire time? And she's been watching us. That's one thing I forgot in episode 7. She was invisible the entire time. There's no shot she is right now though, right? I mean, if an idol like this does promo for this restaurant saying it's my parents, then... Hello mom and dad. We're doing a mukbang right now. What are we doing? Dobon. What are we doing? <laughs> She's just been saying, Oi, she! Oi, she! I mean, if you're a pretty girl like her, I don't think you need to really say much, but obviously having a diverse vocabulary would help, you know, judge and critique food, but... Oi, she! Wait, it's your parents' shop! Why are you shitting on your parents? <laughs> <laughs> that's fucked up. Wait, wait, that's what I know what you're trying to do, but you just fucking said on like national TV that my parents fucking cooking sucks like it's some fucking 7 Eleven food, but because it's my parents, that's the secret ingredient, right? <laughs> what do you fucking say, bro? <laughs> Shits on parents on TV. <laughs> Oh, Misa, is that you? Oh, it is Misa, but she can't say it, right? Quick, quick, Misa, you know, closure scene. Okay. I feel like it's still a little fucked up that she let in by saying, This shit tastes like generic trash you taste at a convenience store, but it's made with parents' love, and that's why I appreciate it. But it's like, damn, did you really have to say it like that? I know Misa's whole persona is like she has a foul mouth and she has a pure heart, but damn, on TV? You couldn't do this shit in public? You had to do this shit on TV? That shit, that store is never gonna get clients now. No one is gonna go up there, bro. Oh, I mean. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh no, she got pizza sauce! Yeah. <laughs> it is gonna be a last birthday if we fucking eat this shit. 16 year old. Damn, he was 15 throughout this entire thing. Could you imagine being 15 and having to deal with the problems they faced up until now? What the fuck was I doing when I was 15? That's like what? Like grade 9? Grade 10? Bro, I was fucking just playing Maple Story and just like doing the dumbest shit. Like, I can't imagine. <laughs> Extra pizza sauce. Have a nice day. Yeah, he'll force himself to eat it. Oh, she's even feeding us? 
リハビリ中の人には無理させられませんあーあーおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお Yes, the secret ingredient of this food trash, but it's family love, so it's good. It tastes like shit, Ayumi, but I appreciate it because you're my family. Shun's still there, huh? Holy fuck. Depression art for Shun. この病院は大丈夫警察沙汰にはならない僕と同じだエピソード7デプレッション海外 We can't you know track people's power anymore We're fucked I forget Just like not even in terms of like how good of a character he was But like his powers were like so important Cause he was the person that could like find other people's powers right That was like the core of the plan We are cooked bro Sup おへそす And she's gonna be acting cool like nothing ever happened, right? Rocky, not Pocky. The dessert of choice for Yuri anime is when two girls eat at a Pocky from side to side and eventually they get to that point. Oni-san said we're cooked. We are so fucked. What do we do? We need to timely, but we can't. Oh no, I don't think she has the answers, bro. Eat some pocky. Cheer up. What? Go public with it? That's unreasonable. I did propose this before, right? I was like, yo, if he has plunder, why doesn't he just take everyone's powers away? Then we can never get hunted except, you know, you. And then he could, like, vaccinate himself at the end. Could he take it? Could he take that burden? There must be some kind of tipping point when he gets so much power that he goes crazy, yeah? あなたはゆみちゃんを救うために未来から帰ってきたり、あのカンニングマだと思っていましたが、今のあなた。I think our relationship is getting better? 私の策にしては無謀が過ぎました。忘れてください。Okay, well, looks like now is putting up a brave face and she's not really talking what happened to her, but okay. We're gonna go around collecting all the powers? But like this could also only happen during this like he did turn 16 so maybe it's safe to say he has like up to until 18 to like do it. So like what Charlotte season 2 and beyond is all about like traveling across the world to collect the powers and make sure that he prevents it? Is, is that it? Also, the comet hit, the comet known as Charlotte hit and it created this dust that kind of like gave people powers. Isn't there one comet or were there multiple comets? Because, like, it hit in Japan, and a lot of people in Japan had the powers, but this shit is also global, implying that either the, the dust spread was so just wide or multiple Charlottes hit Earth and had the similar dust. Because, like, you can't just have all the powers from just one comet, right? It just seems kind of unreasonable, right? I mean, it didn't hit Earth? Oh, it was just traveling and it was like chemtrails. Okay, it's chemtrails. <laughs> so, you know the conspiracy theory chemtrail? They're saying, that's right, brother. Them planes up in the sky turn out them, you know, fucking wildfires. Them chemtrail turned designed to control you. But the, the meteor, the Charlotte, was basically just going across the earth and the dust was falling down on earth and everyone on earth got it. That makes a lot more sense. Got it. Oh, what? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that's, like not, that's classic Tomori acting. Huh? <laughs> you broke confesses, huh? Yeah. 
out. I, I like you. He is serious. <laughs> episode 7, bro. You were there. No one was there. And you were there for him in episode 7. I have no idea. Bro, everything you've done for him is so supportive. <laughs> oh, because episode 7 didn't happen in this timeline. I see, I see. So I guess the legend of the infamous, you know, Dango eating slayer of that neighborhood is no longer a legend because all that shit didn't happen. Which means the pancake girl, we don't have to feel bad at the pancake girl for kicking a shitload of cans at her saying, get me some fucking ramen. None of that shit happened either. Oh, that, okay, okay, there's, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this gotta be the most aggressive confession scene I've ever seen in my life. Are you sure they're in love? They've got, I mean, they're pretty much like 10 years into marriage if you look at this, right? It's like a bickering couple already. <laughs> I still love you! Good for you, I'm out. <sighs> That's crazy. We ain't gonna get a Kramakuchi until he goes around saving the world from the X-Men? Are you serious? We gotta save everybody, take everybody's powers, become this godlike being that's gonna be hunted by the government because we have the power to end humanity and then she'll accept her love. Jesus Christ. What the fuck now? <laughs> Maybe, or by then it'll be too late. Like, knowing this fucking author, he's gonna make it so cruel by the time that he's able to, you know, save everyone and gets to that point, there'll be some kind of fucked up plot mechanic that happens where they can't be together anymore. Pinky promise. This is such a flag, bro. This is gonna collapse in the worst way possible, dude. He might actually, bro. He might actually have to cut his finger off in the future because of this, bro. <laughs> what are you? Whoa, 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 Isn't this a little bit too specific? It, it, it'll be like in the future where he has to endure all this. It is, is oddly specific, you know, trials because the enemies are doing something to him and he's going to remind himself, oh yeah, that time I'll do it for now. Like, what the fuck is this, dude? It's almost as if the author has already figured out the fucked up shit that's going to happen in the future and is like bringing those elements back here now as a flag. What? Out of context anime scenes. Imagine plunder doesn't work anymore because his uh, his right eye doesn't work. Imagine, bro, that would be so fucking funny and sad if it's like, what? I, I can't plunder anymore. And then she's like, well, our love thing condition is done. Goodbye. Plunder, it works. Nice. Now prove it. Turn invisible. I got a plan, Nissan. <laughs> I love how he looks up here, as if you can see him. I, I love how he does this, as if he's not fucking blind. I don't know, we need like a radar, bro. So there must be other radar powers, and he can like go figure out, plunder that, and we're back. We're all back. All right, it's possible. Maybe there's another power like Time Leap. Maybe there's a power called Time Jump where you can go back in the past and you don't turn blind. Imagine that, bro. A lot of resources. <laughs> I 
if we can't at least pull that off, then I won't be able to look him in the eye. Bitch, you fucking blind and Kumagawa, he's fucking dead. Look at what, bro? He's got like two years before the power goes away, I think. Misa. Oh, we're getting everything? I mean, yeah, I guess it makes sense. If we take Yusarin's power, we have the power to let us be possessed by people who have died. I still don't know that mechanic. But could we not, like, get Poo? Why can't Poo possess us and we even use Poo's power like that? What is preventing... I never really understood how Nisa kind of took over Yusarin, but like, Yusarin's power is able to channel to the afterlife and like, talk to, you know, possess the body with like, dead people. Like, Pooh, is he just... Hello? H hello? Does it have to be the sister Link? I... Got a cool scar now on his face. Looks like Zoro, bro. イサさん、実はお姉さんから手紙を預かっています。え最高に楽しかった。生徒会のあいつらとつるんでるのが楽しかった。ただ一つ辛かったのは、ユサ、お前とずっと一緒にいたのにずっと見愛してる。では、死人